Okay, guys. This video is on outliers. How can we detect an outliers? So, outliers is an extreme value. Uh, a number which is can be considered as extreme, which is outside the pattern of a data. If you go through, if you visually inspect the sales in column B here, you can see that maybe uh, observation A9 and A10 can be regarded as extreme because 60 is like it's unusual if compared to the others and also A10 with a sale of 290 is also unusual if compared to the other observations okay first of all how can you detect outliers there are two ways of doing it first by using what is what is called Z or Z score technique and another one is by using quartile technique today I'm showing you how to use Z score technique in order to find uh, outliers and it is very simple okay first look for the Z score for each of these observations if you can recall back Z score formula parentheses the observation minus mean close parenthesis divide by the standard deviation of the mean okay, that score for observation A is 0 0.69 so I would like to find the Z score for the rest of the observation here without having to go through again the Excel formula before that just you have to lock the mean cell and the standard deviation cell so just lock it by having this dollar symbol Once you have done that, we just drag. Okay, so now we have our Z score for each of the observation. And then we can now look for the outliers. So if the question or the rule is that outliers should not be more than three, of the standard deviation and it cannot be less than three of the standard deviation again I repeat a value should not be more than three of a standard deviation and a value cannot be less than negative three of a standard deviation if the number is less than negative three or it is more than three the value data here in the Z score can be considered as outliers so very easy how to detect outliers we use the excel functions of n okay put the z score the first condition that it is more than 3 sorry more than negative 3 and the second condition that the Z score should be less than 3 and put true we'll see okay meaning that the first Z score here has a value of less than 3 and more than negative 3 that's why the function has a result of true Okay, I want to drag down the whole thing here. As usual, we have to lock the cell of E1 and H1. Okay, E1 stands for negative 3 and H1 stands for 3.
So if you drag down the whole thing here, so look, out of the observation, the result for the last two observations produce false. So these two are false. So what does it mean? These two observations are outliers. So in the context of business analysis, when there are two observations that are considered as outliers, the business manager should be able to interpret why are the two observations are considered outliers. And this might be meaningful for the decision making of a particular business organizations. Okay, thank you.